You have tuned in to All Viral Access Media. What's up? This your girl, Gemini the Queen out of Ohio. You have now tuned in to All Viral Access Media. You now tuned in to All Viral Access Media. You dig? So it's, a lot of, so it's a lot of things Lifetime did. So basically what Lifetime told you one thing and they try to get some yeah. things out of you and they edit it in a way to make you look a certain yes. way. Yes, I mean, Let's they talk got about you that. thinking I'm working with him now. They got you thinking I've been with him for the last 20 years. Now I ain't been with Robert since 95. Oh, wow, shit. They they you sure have, they fooled me. Right, see, people think I've been with him doing all he's, all of this. And I, Word, I, I, wow, I didn't know that. I ain't know it been since I mean, 95. I've, been in, I've never, I've, my, I've been, I still know it because, see, everything he's going through, that's why I say my book was written eight years ago about everything they talk, talking about. Wait, so wait, those wait. people are all inside my book, and I'm looking at them say what they're saying, and I'm like, what? I wrote about y'all. Wow, really? You 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 you, you want them one that's sleeping in the bed with three, four women with him? You, it, huh? Who? Women. You, you didn't hear me say little girls. I'm yeah, talking about women. You know, I, I, I chose his dancers. I mean, I was with him when he chose them. You know, when he chose his wife, she was a dancer. Uh, right. He was married. I mean, he wasn't married to Aaliyah, but, you know, it was right after Aaliyah that he married her. So all before that, she was with him. And she was doing all them threesomes and, and all that stuff, too. She, I, I, look. I, I can't, I've never seen him. Right. I don't, you don't see Robert do stuff like that, man. And so I, I'm, I'm the tour manager. So pretty much I was with him all. Everything that went on, I was the manager. I was the tour man. I was out there on the road. I'm the one that organized his time to, you know, when we get to a city, take him to the mall. Right back then, malls were new. Yeah, absolutely. So he malls, was malls, malls was the thing, things to go that to. Was the so. thing, that was the place to go. Yeah. And so he wanted to go. I took him to the mall. There, I didn't take him, but I scheduled him to go to the mall in every city. And then after the mall, he go play ball. After he play ball, hopefully it's time to do a sound check. But he's still not tired. So after that, he's going to eat at McDonald's. These were easy things for me to keep a track on him. His security was with him. And now I'm, I'm, I'm looking that I'm watching a pattern now. After the shows, I'm staying at the venues a long time. Past the time we're supposed to be there because he's signing autographs and, you know, having his fun. And I'm looking at the, uh, the, the lines and they're like the younger girls. Not yeah. to say they're babies, but they're the younger girls. It's like maybe teenagers, and I'm like, hold on, man, this is not cool, you know. And so now I'm fighting everybody. You see, now I'm, hold on, man, what's going on? You know, I'm, I'm looking at this note stuff first. Now I'm, I'm intercepting notes. And I'm saying, hey, hold on, man. And then I'm starting, now I go out there and get girls. Now I'm going to get women. Because I'm thinking, I'm, I got a defense now. Let me, let me get Robert this woman here. She's beautiful. Let me go talk to her and see if she wants to call anybody wants me. And I'll be, you know, I'll pick somebody, you know, uh, he's got to go. Can I meet him? No, he's got to get out of there. I know if he talks to you, he's going he's gonna to want to stay in there and talk to you. And I really got to get to the next city. I won't be long. I just want to, I just want to hug him. I say, yeah, but you don't want to do more than that. <laughs> and I want me to tell you what she'll do. She'll say, well, I, I'll do whatever you want. I just, I won't keep him in there long. And then I, and she's beautiful. And, and, you know, I don't mess with, you know, and I, I and she loved him. I'm, I'm looking at her, you know, you, I'm not picking up. I don't think I'm picking up. I'm a good discerner. So, and I, it would be somebody I would date. I don't right, mistreat right. women. I'm picking somebody, hopefully this man could like. Right. So that we can, we can eliminate this teenage attitude that they're traveling with. I'm, I'm like on the road with a bunch of kids. You see? And so um, he would entertain those women. And, uh, but, you know, after which he wanted to be with his buddies. And his buddies were... Uh, a teenage minded and that's who they are so so that was always um uh, hectic for me on the road in a, in a sense to be able to um help raise all them the kids <laughs> you know <laughs> right. robert robert was like a big kid man you know he wanted and it was new to him and he had power and he wanted and he and he and he distributed it. he wanted to do everybody's job because he wanted everybody's job to be as right as he was with his music Right. Because he got this new known power that uh, he never had. And it, that money is powerful. And that's what got him where he is because it's like the blind leading the blind. Let me ask, you, me. Let me ask you this. Mm -hmm. Now, 
I remember when you said this. Now, please take a step by step, okay? When you was in a hotel room, I think I had two rooms or some some shit like that. Oh, you talking about that? Um, so yeah. I'm going to answer that for you, and then I hope I can close that. Yeah, yeah, that please. Yeah, yeah. I, I just want to do it for, for my platform. Please, For yeah. your platform, I'm going to do this. But first, I'm going to say, why would a man, period, right. be asking me about, I mean, we were just having, it was like we're offline, like me and you offline. Now we're talking, we're saying, and you think, well, yeah. No, man, I don't really think so. But at the same time, I mean, you know, looking at the way things are, looking at what you <laughs> read, you know. And I remember one time Robert told his brother, something bad about me and i was like it hurt my feelings like i'm about the gangster nigga you know and you said that and so well, basically what I, I thought about that at a moment and then i mentioned something that happened with us in new york and i did i said hey man uh and I, but as i came up as a kid um, i would go through my high school there at times and um not me and my buddies but some of well, I'm few of my buddies every now and then they would streak up across the football field. Right, right. You know, mm -hmm. just, you know, streaking. That's all that was at that day. It was just a streak, and I took it and, and put a little. Yeah, I remember we had just left two girls in New York, and uh, a robber came in the room. We had, they had left, and Robert come running in my room, butt naked, and walked over to the dress. You know, you want that was a big kid to me. I didn't look at that as serious, and then I said at the same time I said something else frivolous after that. But it, it, I didn't mean to do that. And now for me to sit here and defend that, I have to ask myself and I ask my, to the people, it's like, why do you want to know about a man's sexual preference? Period. Yeah, I, 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 I why hear Why would you. you ask me about it? Not you, no, no, I got you. because I'm glad you asked me because I do want to clear that up. It's like, I don't want to sit there. I, I don't think that he was gay. No, I didn't think he was gay. I thought he was a big kid playing. That's what I thought. And mm -hmm. I'm not gay. And so let's close that because I... All right. That's what are you do in that bedroom. That's your business. Absolutely. You I, I just, and, I, I, and I'm insulted for you to come out the bedroom and talk about what I did. Come, I got freaky ways too. But I ain't, you know, that's my business. Right. You know what I'm <laughs> right. So let's close that, man. That's, I'm glad you asked that because, no, uh, I, I, Robert ain't approached me to, 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 to have, no, man, no. I can't even say that shit. Right. You know what I'm saying? So right. I hate that's that good. I said that to that guy. And I, 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 I'm, I'm, I regret that he did that. And I just, I wouldn't have never printed him. I mean, you just needed something to make you, uh, your, your, your views go up. So you put something like that out there. Let's, let's, let's have a brighter mind than that, man. That's, it's the little things that's, that's ugly. It's the spirit in a man that's ugly. And that is an ugly spirit. Right. Now. That's somebody throwing a wrench in there. Now, so you mm -hmm. said, I just got a few more questions. So, um, yes, sir. so you said, um. You left him in '95 because I want you to explain some things in your book too towards the end. So, but you said so you left him around '95, and when he had that situation with um, uh, Roshana, that was in '99, and it came out in 2000 or 2001. Did you see her at any given time when you've been around um, him or like Sparkle as well? Did you see Sparkle or her niece? Yes. I never, I never saw Sparkle. Uh, oh, so you seen uh, the niece? public announcement was um well i used to see sana come around and she was babysitting for andrea you know for his wife at one time i went to the uh, they did i wish they, i wish the remix but damn how um, old she was then that. she she babysitting at the age of what one shit no she nah. was young i mean nah, i wish nah. when he do the i wish video that was in um let me see the i wish remix video i mean i've seen her before because i mean i've seen her and she was she was she was a, a stout young lady a stout young girl, uh, and and when she comes, she was a kid. She was a little girl, and she, uh, from when I saw her, somebody was always with her. Somebody brought her. She didn't just happen upon her. And I didn't, you know, I don't look at those things because. But now when she come out, I often remember her. But I didn't see things happening like that. I didn't see that. That she'll come around me and stand around me when Robert's shooting a video, and and I know she's she's a kid, but I know. I got to cover her because her family is right here and they all know Robert. So I'm not looking at her to look at that's her. That's a, that's a kid and she with her people. So mm -hmm. my attention is all for her, like in respect to Robert being, a, I never saw nothing like that. Right. But, you know, when you look at, um, I never, I never saw that, you know, I saw her, but she wasn't, she didn't just happen there. Now for, um, you know, they found him not guilty with that. And that's how, that's how I look at that right now, because to me, that's closed because 
I mean, it's an ugly thing, and people consume that they want who it is, and but they found them not guilty. So how can I, you know, that's the court of law. How can I keep, you know, my opinion of that is 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 double jeopardy right now, and that's what I think Lifetime did to him with this. You see, we can think that it was wrong, but right now, because he was turned to lose, Robert has to answer to that with, with, with his creator. You see, because you reap what you sow. So I don't want to be the one to push him in the corner when I know that everybody has done something uh, wrong and everybody didn't get away with it, but he found a way to get out of it. And they, I mean, they found him not guilty. And that's why I, I stand on that. I can't. You know, no, I, I get that. No, I definitely get that. You know, and then on top of that, you know, at the end of the day, her parents most he right. they, they they definitely got right. paid off though. I so mean, he had, he I definitely had to pay. Them. Still be on it now anyway. We can assume that we wouldn't do that with our children. Absolutely but, not. And and but see that they're her parents, so I have to stay out of that. I mean, I can think that is immoral and wrong, but that's me. But that's not my daughter. You see. That's and that's not that's her family and I, I I I have a love for them because they're people. But when it comes to um, me seeing a pretty little girl going around with Robert Kelly, I, I'm not. That's not my responsibility to monitor her and her parents. Are here. Okay, now, if it ain't nobody here and that little girl is here. Hold on, man. What, where she? Who's she with? You got to go back with your family, baby. Go, go on on out here. That's my. That's what I am. No, I, I got you. Now, um, before before we close out, is there anything mm -hmm. that you seen that gave you any suspicion that this guy loved the young women and and certain things that he was doing? It was like, no, even though I know you have a kid mind or whatever, you play a lot, but you were grown man. Like, w w what's your intentions <clears throat> with these young girls? Cause you know, going to the mall, he pick up some young girls. That's how he he. That's how he met fucking I ain't never seen young Lizette. Girls, it's like you talk about public announcement. I'm, I'm listening to them right now on the internet and how, what they're saying. It's like, I was right there with y'all, man. And I'm never, and, and this is my honest opinion, man. I'm, it's my honest truth. I have never seen Aaliyah on a tour bus with Robert alone, period. I don't even remember Aaliyah being on the bus and I'm the one that hired the buses. <laughs> you see, and every time they got on them, I assigned them. Not to say that Nobody, I'm not saying what you saw, but I just don't. I mean, and then if you saw something like that and you say it was sick, I mean, now that's different than me going to get a license. You see, taking her to get a, to get a life, get an ID to get a license. If I saw him having sex with her, with her man, listen, I would have snapped. I really would have in that respect because now, man, that's something. That's, that was... but. The other situation was a bit different, and I was in a different position. But if you saw that, then you just left, and you thought it was sick, so you allowed a sick person to mess with a child. And I don't think you should have brought that up this far in the game because where's your proof? So let's stop doing with speculation and, and insinuating things because this is this man's life right now, man. Right. Hey. You know, I, I'm, 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 I'm not. Me personally, you're not judging. You're just getting the story out there. You abs wanna, absolutely. People got answers. You're in the business of right. You, you like the business of getting the news out there, and, and um, absolutely. We, we, and I have to tell my truth right now. I let, I let the people decide. So I try to right. look at things from both sides, and and then um, you know. I got issues with Rob, man. I got issues. Now, I mean, now I that's what play. I want to get into. Let now, since let, that's a great segue, let's get into that. But they're my issues. <laughs> but, but, they're my issues I, with him, I, and they are personal. They, they would be, right, but they, there I mean, is like some that's brother. but he's there like is my, some that's public he's like though. My, uh, he's my family, so you know how brothers and sisters. Of I course, got, I got family I ain't talked to in years, but boy, if they call me, I'm coming. Absolutely, and that's one of these times. Because they putting them on a witness on, a, on they putting them in front of a court of people and he already been found not guilty. So why are you doing this all over again? That was wrong. And yeah, everybody I, on that panel know that they're not telling they full truth. Absolutely. Like, 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 like I said, like like I said, like how you like how, damn. I, I, I'm trying. I, I try not to say too much, but I per, me personally is connected to. Robert, I don't know him, but I, I, I definitely, 
I have that. So I, I, I just don't want to say too much. So, but I know enough. Let me say this so I can close this because I, uh, there's two things in life that never change, man. That's love and that's the truth. Absolutely. And I have both of those with Robert. So therefore, I'm connected. Now, me and him got an issue. Me and him go toe to toe, but you can't touch him. Absolutely. He's not in front of me. That's a fact. So man. now, that's where I stand. Okay, now, um, 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 who Listen. he is, I know what he's built from. Okay, so I'm, I'm deeper. Now, when it comes to those ladies on the stage, I'm not trying to say they were not abused, man. I'm not trying to say that. But I'm trying to say that. Let's get an understanding of what you what abuse is. Let's do it. Yeah, of course. You yes. see? Mm -hmm. Now, to me, an under, abuse for me, I'm saying for me, abuse in all areas is self-inflicted for me, except for a child. Anybody that put their hand on the child is just, that's wrong. But abuse for me, you have to walk into it. You have to be receptive to it. You see? And when you're walking out of character, then you're walking into abuse. And when you, when you don't know who you are, you're walking into abuse, man. And that's what they, they, they don't understand. They're not talking about the part that they played in, in the relationship. Absolutely. See, and there's a respect and there's love. A woman is love. That's who a woman is. She walks in love. But a lot of women look for respect. See, I want respect from you. I want respect from my woman. That's what I want. And I'm going to give my woman love, and I'm going to give you respect. Absolutely. And every woman, every woman, I'm going to give her love. I ain't saying make love, but she's soft and she's tender, and I have to treat her with, with, with compassion and love. And delicacy. In every aspect. And delicacy. Right. Yeah, because she's my comforter. When I see a woman and I'm cursing, I got to... Stop and say, oh, hold on, man. That's a woman. I got to love her. Not respect her. I got to love her. Now, here's the woman. I'm bringing nothing but love to you. Or now I'm bringing some ugliness to you. Hold on. You ain't respect me. No, baby. I ain't loving you. You're supposed to be receptive to who you are. You are love. So when you're receptive to love, then you won't be, allow yourself to be hurt. Now, when you accept these things that come to you that are not love, and if you're looking for respect, then you need to be standing toe-to-toe -to -toe with somebody because respect goes to battle. See, when your woman talks back to you, that's a, a form of no respect. Not that you, she's not, she's, you're stronger than her. God made us different. And if we walk in our element, then we eliminate abuse. Abuse is the only thing I know that stands alone. You've got positive, you got negative, you got him, you got her, you got... You got a uh, uh, duh. You got you got everything that's positive that's, that works as one. When you plug the plug into the wall, the positive and the negative don't work against each other. They both stand in their element. We are out of our elements. Women look for respect, and and the greatest thing of all is love. How could you feel? How could you not want love and want respect when love is everything? Love is God. Absolutely. So you want you want to just pour respect out of love? No, you have to give respect, woman. You are love. So stop looking for who you are. Walk in it, my brother. You are respect. Walk in it. Absolutely. Now that's Jules from the man himself. Now I just want to just make this real quick, and then we on definitely want to close this out. I just want to yes, say, sir. far as this whole thing, I'm not blaming R. Kelly. I think they both got faults in this i think some of these women some of these parents knew exactly what the hell they was doing and a lot of them is just pulling up old stuff they, they knew what they was doing before they even met this guy they heard about the, these allegations and stuff and y'all still of, to do that. a so, beautiful lifestyle exactly a, and, and, and a lot of them know. don't want to go home so but from right. what, what what i know that he's a dominant these women has to be submissive when he's dealing with this dude, and a lot well, of them don't, don't have to be submissive. But, but no, but they don't. They don't have to be. That's what I'm saying. If you're dealing with somebody that 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 has this lifestyle that you want and all stuff like that, so in order, right. if you want to live then, in in that then world, you give him, then you you give give him, him you please him exactly. You, give him you your please love, him, and, and you did. want stuff. He got you. So and, and a lot of them don't even want to go home. So they don't. Even, now, they don't even want to leave because they don't want to go back to now, a regular lifestyle. And I'm talking about those yeah. who's there that they yeah. may know right now. 
who, who I'm talking they, about. They, they fell out of love. They felt they didn't really love him. And now they, well, they're, not to say they didn't love him. They now feel like they were disrespected, and they weren't. They're not receptive to what the love that he's given them anymore. So now they need right. to go home. But now what you right. now you're angry girlfriend. That's now all. you're angry and now, now. And I'm not saying that. I mean, I done had my girlfriends. I didn't grab girls. I didn't. I'm not gonna hurt none of them. But sometimes they talk back, and I say, "Babe, please don't. Please, please let me alone, please." And they still bother me. Get on away from me. That's abuse because I, in, in the society's world, because I put my, I might have sat her down. But if she's abusing me by standing toe to toe with me. She's not respecting me. If you be quiet for a minute, then maybe, and if I keep on coming to you crazy, then I'm not loving you. So don't stay for that. And they stayed. Mm. They stayed. His girlfriend, his, I mean, the dancer was always there. I mean, I look at a whole lot of things when I look at her and those girls. Robert Kelly was married. That's right. And and, that's the bottom line. Do you want to do you want to talk a little bit about your book before we close out, or is it's up to you? Do you want to share something? Yeah, yeah. Let me share that because I do got to go. I'm, 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 that's fine. That's fine. Go, go right ahead, brother. But my book is entitled "The Man Behind the Man," looking from the inside out. It's on Amazon. It's on uh, Barnes and Noble. It's on Google Google Books. And um, I wrote that book in prison, and. Um, I got revelation from it, and I put it out eight years ago. And pretty much, it's a it's a book that talks about everything that's going on and about what you're what you're looking for. The answers are there, and they give us revelation to different things about having understanding. That's what I got out of that book, an understanding to myself because I was one that was. Um, I could say that I was a victim under Robert, but see. I opened myself up to that. I, I stayed in that. So the book is a good book, and if you look at it and you look at the uh, uh, the reviews, you'll see. It's very entertaining, and I think that it's an educational book. And um, Robert's uh, beginning, it was very, very, um, it's very informative on that. And uh, we see the characteristics, and if they would have looked at that book eight years ago, they would have seen that, hey, man, let's look at this brother. Let's see, I mean, this, this book is really giving some character traits to look at. You see, and they, didn't, they knew about the book. Everybody did. But the media kept it closed. And, um, that's, and they, let, they, let, you know, they kept turning their heads to things that, and he ain't really did nothing, man. Robert ain't really did nothing. He got, he forgive me for everything, but, you know, he, the, the, the picture that that place point painted of him is really an ugly picture. And, I think that I mean I, I I I don't like younger girls myself, but you know um, that's not a subject anymore because they found them not guilty. In certain states, girls sixteen or in, in Michigan, they're sixteen years old is legitimate. I mean they are, they have at seventeen as Illinois. So you know um, when you look at the law, I try to keep it, my my everything into that. So uh, it, to me, it's double jeopardy. So I, I just. I, I want to be. I want healing to come for everybody for this because I'm really tired of everybody um, bringing up Lee. I just want that to be gone, and I want to. Um, Robert's going through a whole lot, and I know the girls are going through a whole lot. But we have to have understanding because one person doesn't bear all the blame. Okay? Absolutely, that's right. So absolutely, I hope that's that helps you, man, and I hope people got some information. I hope you go get my book, The Man Behind the Man, looking from the inside out. If I was out there to be a, a a person that was out there trying to get the money, I would have hired a publicist eight years ago and brought this out. But um, they gave me a boost, and so I just I sit there and I ride on it. So it's a good book, and I hope that you get it and you enjoy and you enjoy it. And we, I hope that you keep all the victims that feel they're victims, and I hope that you keep also Robert Kelly in your prayers, man. because Absolutely. he's God's child. Because every good gift comes from God. We all are. Absolutely. Well, I thank you. I want to thank you for giving me your time and your blessings and um, your your words and everything. Thank you, man. I definitely appreciate you because you definitely didn't have to do this. So I definitely want to say thank you and I appreciate you. Thank you, man. Thank you for being patient with me and for listening. God bless you and keep you. All right. All right. And um, text me your links and stuff so I can put everything in the description box to um to get your book. Will do. Thank you, bro. Peace, Bye. brother. Have a good one. You too. Peace. Hello, Mike. I
tune in to All Viral Access Media. Make sure you subscribe to All Viral Access Media, where real conversation that matters goes down. Love this channel.